Oh hey, didn't see that. Today we'll be outlining the SOP for the nitrate caffeine reduction method, necessary components for the HAP 2010 spectrophotometer. We have the distilled water, parafilm, we've got a waste jar, we've got the 25 milliliter nitrate reagent powder, we have a timer, the HAC DR2010 spectrophotometer, cubits, and the handbook for the spectrophotometer. Making sure proper quality assurance, quality control tests, as well as following safety in the lab. For lab safety, it's important to wear proper gloves, a lab coat, close toe shoes, eye protection, and if you have long hair or a mullet to tie it back. For quality assurance, quality control in this test, it's important to maintain as much consistency as possible when running the lab procedures. Using the cadmium reduction method in our cookbook, following it, the detailed procedures every time, using this, the same machine when you run the test, having the same two Cubettes, uh, one for the blank and one for the actual sample, Kim wipes to wipe off fingerprints, some distilled water, and recording any notes that happen during the lab and color changes and results. First step in the nitrate test is to set the program number, which is three, five, three. Then you want to adjust for the correct wavelength using this dial. To 400. Then the next step we will add our distilled water and sample water to our cubex, followed by pillow packets in each one and covered by parafilm. We'll add the water to 25 milliliters, which will be labeled in the cubet. And after that we will shake for three minutes to speed up the reaction. All of that. Process, we need to encourage the reaction. So we will shake for a minute by pressing shift 5 or timer, and a minute should come up. Yes, and just shake for a minute. After we shake for a minute, we will let it sit for five minutes, and we will time this by pressing shift timer and just letting it sit. Now 
anyway, QC is critically important um, as a part, a fundamental part of the analysis of surface waters. It's important to establish the reliability and the correctness of analytical data, first and foremost. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I hope it helped. Gwen is awesome.